About a year and a half ago, she found a photo that we had posted on the Tourism Saskatoon Instagram feed. We were sharing content from another local who's proud of their city, had a beautiful shot of the river with, you know, a little bit of the beach and very active. And uh, she was looking to make a change. And from what Jalomi told me is, she didn't want one of the usual suspects. So she didn't want some of the more obvious destinations. And so she couldn't even say Saskatoon, according to her. But this was something that particular photo caught her eye. And so she started following some of our social media channels and ended up making a decision to just make a change and move to Canada, move to a place she had never heard of and moved here, uh, I believe, about four or five months ago. It just, it looked inviting. It looked uh, pretty. Of course, our River Valley is so scenic and beautiful. And so I think that it just immediately caught her attention and probably the name of the city you know, it, it is memorable for some people and so sometimes that is, is a way that we can get attention for our destination is just even by saying Saskatoon, Saskatchewan, it, you sort of perk up people's ears sometimes. Mm. She's been getting so involved in the community and the thing that she kept mentioning and coming back to, which I love so much, is our people and how welcoming they are and I'm really lucky in the role I have at Tourism Saskatoon as Director of Media. I get to host travel writers who have traveled the whole world and time and time again, especially those writers from the bigger centres like Toronto or LA, New York, they say, I can't believe how warm and welcoming people were. We take that for granted here, but that really is truly something special about our community. I, I work quite hard at dispelling the myths that we're barns and silos, that we're a quiet, sleepy town. I really want people to understand we're the second youngest demographic in the country. We have a lot of uh, vibrancy, a lot going on as far as culinary, arts, festivals and events, sports. There's so many things happening here and it's just, we're right now really building on one another, uh, all of these different things that are happening and I just think that it's Saskatoon's time to shine right now and it's really exciting to be in tourism at a time like this.